delayed flight, delayed reaction time, delayed shipping. Being delayed usually isn't a good thing. So why delayed sword? Hey, what's up everybody? My name is Jesse and I'm the founder and grandmaster of MMA, Mexican Martial Arts. In case you don't know, we already took American Kempo and made it better. We call it Mexican American Kempo. But since then, people have been asking us to dive even deeper. So I'm gonna be breaking down individual techniques for you. Today, we're gonna be looking at the lay sword. As I do that, I'm gonna do an inward block. I'm gonna drop back and kick and then chop to the carotid artery. This is the homie, Measure P, and he's gonna be Don't Sweat the Technique. Helping me demonstrate. If you've watched our live videos, then he's one of the fools behind the scenes. And I just wanna address something real quick. A lot of people have been asking about, where's Flaco? He's actually going to school right now to become a dental assistant, so he's not always available, but he's not gone forever for now. <laughs> All right, so the attack is gonna be a right hand push. I'll tell you when to do it. So typically, once he pushes, now go ahead. You're gonna wanna step back into a right fighting stance while also stopping the push with the right inward block. By doing this, I've created enough distance to both avoid his attack and follow up with a front kick to the groin. Oh! And follow up with a front kick to the groin. Oh! This will undoubtedly and without fail cause him to lean forward right into my hand sword. Ah! Crossover cover out. I'm sure you could see why they call it delayed sword now it took way too long to get there now let's fix that there's a concept called intercepting fist with roots in jeet kune do and wing chun that can take this technique from delayed sword to instant sword the moment the attacker starts to push the sword is instant you see with intercepting fist you don't block and then strike back. The moment that you see your opponent is attacking, you attack. You see, you gotta remember. For reals? Whose phone is that? Hey, whose phone is that? I think that's yours, fool. What's up? It's your phone. <laughs> Hey, what's up? A dojo? Oh, that's what's up. Like what kind of stuff? Like gloves, shin guards, striking pads, etc. Nah, fool, chale. More like never last. You're gonna wanna go with Hayabusa. Yeah, fool, that's the one. That's what GSP uses. Serio. They're having a back to school special right now. If you spend $99, then you can get stuff from their final round line for as low as $4.99. For reals, I'm talking about gym bags, geese, shin guards, y todo. Nah, fool, I put that on everything. I'm not playing around. They're actually sponsoring the video that I'm doing right now. For reals, I get a percentage from every sale. All right, yeah, I'm gonna put the link in the description and in the comment section below. So just make sure that you use that one. All right, bro, I appreciate it. All right, good looking out. Late. I hate that fool. I thought it was somebody else when I answered it. All right, let's get the camera back on. Now, hold up, I need to change my beanie. Remember, if this fool's trying to take your life, the lay sword is delaying you from safety. Instant sword is the way to go. Let me know in the comment section below which technique you would like to see me improve next. 
Thank you for watching Mexican martial arts. Appreciate it. Good looking out. Late. Peace, 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 peace.